19th November No problem too big Isaiah chapter 37 The angel of the Lord went out and put to death 185,000 men in the Assyrian camp Isaiah chapter 37 verse 36 Sennacherib boasted of his military might and his great conquests but the king of Assyria forgot that he was only God's tool for accomplishing his purposes on the earth and the tool must not boast against the maker chapter 10 verses 5 to 19 god would humble sennacherib chapter 37 verses 7 and 29 the assyrian commander had joked that one assyrian junior officer was stronger than 2000 jewish horsemen chapter 36 verses 8 to 9 but it took only one of god's angels to destroy 185000 assyrian soldiers Isaiah had prophesied the destruction of the Assyrian army. God would mow them down like a forest. Chapter 10 verses 33 to 34. Devastate them with a storm. Chapter 30 verses 27 to 30. And throw them into the fire like garbage on the city dump. Verses 31 to verse 33. After Sennacherib left Judah, a defeated man, he returned to his capital city of Nineveh. Twenty years later, as a result of a power struggle among his sons, Sennacherib was assassinated by two of his sons in fulfillment of Isaiah's prophecy, chapter 37, verse 7, and it happened in the temple of his god. Verse 38, the field commander had ridiculed the gods of the nations, but Sennacherib's own god could not protect him. Something to ponder. What can you learn from the story to apply to stressful situations you are currently facing? Amen.